All right, people have been asking for me to do this for some time, and I, I kind of resisted. I resisted uh, doing a Tristan Wirfs breakdown of the divisional game versus the Saints. Good win for, uh, for the Bucks. Good game for Wirfs. If this is your first time watching this channel, well, this channel is actually new. It's, it's sistered off of the Talking Giants channel. But what I did all season is every week I broke down Andrew Thomas, Mekhi Becton, and Jedrick Wills and just let other people compare them. Like, hey, this is the good plays. These are the bad plays. Here's what's in the middle. Um, and just like, hey, these are the three left tackles. But I didn't do Tristan because he was the fourth guy off the board. And just he didn't play left tackle. So I didn't think it was fair to compare them. Um, and also time. I mean, it takes me, you know, a, a few hours to do just do one of these guys. But I thought this was a really good game for Worfs. And I see why people love him, man. Because he's so freaking strong and sturdy. And we'll see uh, what he does against Cam Jordan, who, you know, is a really good defensive end. Uh, it's third time around uh, against him. But uh, Bucks fans, I know you are. Th I mean, one, you're thrilled to be going to the NFC Championship, um, but you got to be thrilled with your with your rookie right tackle. Just nice passers will go through it. Watch the hands. Puts that first hand in his chest to keep Jordan totally out of him, and then Cam Cam goes like to swipe that right hand out, but with that. Tristan doesn't lean at all. Moves his, gets his feet. And then does a little mini of that hop step. We were talking about this with Jedrick Wills last week. Andrew Thomas used this a ton. When you know that bull is coming, hop. Two feet. Bam, hop. Hop and anchor. I mean, worse is a technician, man. More than, I, I thought Wills was a technician out of this group. To me, it, it's worse. Here, this type of rep was very common, and it's interesting. And we'll we'll go through it over and over with, with different reps. But he's setting. He's opening up his hips a little early, but it's not, not you know, not bad. He's not totally opening him up. So Cam Jordan does this hand swipe with the right hand. Hand swipe, and then the left hand to swim to and, 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 and rip through. But Tristan lets him do it. And then when he's on him, he kind of... Like, moves his feet. And it's because Tristan is just so strong with his lower body. Like, he's so sturdy that that doesn't. Where a lot of tackles, when Cam Jordan does that to them, I mean, they are facing straight, you know, they, they're at a 90-degree angle because of that strength of Cam Jordan. Where worse is just kind of like business as usual. And then gets back in the set. Like, that's got to be frustrating for Cam Jordan. He's like, man, that works against damn near every tackle in the league. That he doesn't let his he doesn't let his feet stop moving or move forward. I mean, he's just ready. Again, same thing. Even that, like that wasn't like perfect by Worfs. But he's so strong he's able to get away with it. Like you see the chop by Cam. And then uses that left hand to like club over. I mean, that right there, you think defensive end wins this rep. Like, easy easy rep for the defensive end. Because, like, you see, it's not even like a... I mean, and then he pulls that right hand over and rips. And just worse, it's just so strong with his lower body. That, yeah, does he get a little bit out of place? But he doesn't... The rep's not, the, not wrecked. You know? Like, it's not a perfect rep by worse. But it's not wrecked. Where a lot of guys, that rep is totally wrecked. See, the same thing here, man. I mean, it's, it's just so strong. Sets out towards him. That chop from Jordan. The swim. And look. I mean it just doesn't affect him. Now. You would like to see. Worfs. Instead of letting him do that. And rely on your strength. To right here. Um, Jedrick Wills does this. Where he'll use his right hand. To swipe that hand. And then and then punch with the left. Just so he doesn't get into that bad. You know. A situation like that. I mean, same thing. Like I said, this season, these aren't like perfect reps for Worfs, but his strength and athleticism is just able to overcome. Like, this should be a win for Cam Jordan, but Worfs doesn't lose his balance, keeps his feet moving. And like I said, so it's not a pretty rep, but it's a win. It's a win, and that's, that's just... I mean, it's basically all off of strength. 
Now, Jordan does get him. This is the one rep where I was like, Cam Jordan totally won this rep. So you can see <laughs> Cam Jordan was probably a little tired of, of trying to do what he was doing. So, Worfs, see how his hands are out wide like that? Just totally leaves his chest wide open. And Cam Jordan sees that and just bulls. And he's really, I mean, he's standing up like straight up too. Like I said, this was the one rep where Cam Jordan just got him. I mean, he's got his hands out wide, leaves his chest just ready for Cam Jordan to just bull rush right through. Doesn't punch, and he's standing straight up. Still a hell of a play, play by Brady there. Um, in the run game, we'll go through some of the run plays. Pretty solid. I mean, Bucks didn't run a ton till towards the end of the game. Um, here, Anzalone. Anzalone. The Bucks were punking Anzalone, Anzalone all game. But good feet. Driving. Driving. Now the feet are a little skinny. But I mean, you get your guy off the ball like that, you take the win. Here's a. I love this rep. I love this rep. Short, choppy steps, punch. I mean, look at that hand placement. That is perfect hand placement for works. You got the right hand right here on the num on the on the on the out on the number. Then a left hand on that left shoulder uh, pad, pushing him out, torquing him out. I'm doing it right now while you guys can't see me, but torquing him out. And leaving a lane. Being like, hey, if you need to come inside me, you got. Or I shouldn't say that. I always say stuff like that. And it makes me look bad. And here's one of my favorite things. Jordan goes to redirect. Just keep driving. Keep driving. Don't hold. It's like, you want to redirect? All right. I'm going to just square my feet up and go. Nice combo here. Helps Gronk. Sees Anzalone coming in. Bam. Squares him up. Nice little pop from Anzalone. But once that initial contact happens, Worfs then just drives him back. I wish I wish Jensen wasn't there so Worfs could have just driven him through the back of the end zone. Here, got to use your hands. He's got to use his hands. I get the want to just, you know, lay somebody out. Lay a nice hit. But watch him put his, watch him tuck his shoulder and, and try and do that. And Davis just like, all right, dude, I'll send, I'll send you where you want, where you're going. Is able to make that tackle. If he uses, if he comes up, squares up here, uses those hands to punch, and then try and swing his hips and get that left foot around. Well, then you got, you know, Davis right here, right here. There's a sm a little bit of a lane, maybe, you know, a little bit of a lane, possibly, you know, a little bit of a lane. But because of that, Davis is able to make the play. And here he's just leaning, gets caught leaning, gets caught leaning bad. Good first steps, one, two, and then watch as he stops. He stops his feet. He goes... One, two, the next step doesn't come. He he loads <laughs> and try and and just tries to spring out and lead like and leans like crazy. And Cam just totally swims it. Jordan just totally swims it. Keep those feet moving. Instead of trying to explode out from right here, you put your feet. Put, give me two more steps. He's not able to swim you because you are in this position instead of. This position, and you win that rep. You might have a nice little run, out, you know, you know, on the, on your inside shoulder. But he gets caught leaning, gets in trouble. So, listen, this is the first game I broke down the worst, but I see why people around the league love this guy. You know, I see highlights here and here, and people talk about him, but I like to go do my own homework. And I was I was very impressed with Worfs against you know a really good pass rusher and Cam Jordan, really good player in Cam Jordan, and you could see. 
where that strength is just like, hey, even when he, the rep's not perfect, he's able to win that. Um, you know, and, and a lot like Andrew Thomas, where it's like, yeah, will he um, leave the the edge a little exposed at times? Yeah, but he can he can trust his athleticism around the edge. Becton, where it's like, yeah, is, is his feet always great? Can he he just but he that first punch is so nasty. And Wills is a really a technician. So good divisional round for Tristan Wirth. I'm excited to do this again for the NFC Championship game against the Packers. Got some good players there with Zadarius and Preston Smith. So we'll uh, we'll see how he does. Appreciate it. Please subscribe to the channel. This channel is new. We're separating it uh, from the Talking Giants channel because it is more just NFL related. I'll be going to the Senior Bowl in a week. We're going to have some interviews we'll be dropping on this channel. So just subscribe to the channel. Appreciate you guys. See you next time.